फ्रेंड्स आई एम डॉक्टर अर्पना आई एम अ प्रैक्टिसिंग होम्योपैथिक कंसल्टेंट इन दिस चैनल वी टॉक अबाउट द रोल एंड स्कोप ऑफ होम्योपैथिक मेडिसिन इन द वेरियस मेडिकल कंडीशंस एंड टुडे आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द विटामिन बी ट्वेल्व डेफिशियंसी ऑल्सो नोन एज द कोबेलिमिन डेफिशियंसी नाउ विटामिन बी ट्वेल्व डेफिशियंसी इट कैन रिजल्ट इन आवर नॉन एफिशियंट वर्किंग ऑफ द नर्वस सिस्टम विटामिन बी ट्वेल्व इज अ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट विटामिन फॉर हेल्दी फंक्शनिंग ऑफ आर नर्वस सिस्टम एंड द ब्रेन एंड ऑल्सो द आर बी सीज और द रेड ब्लड सेल्स ऑफ आर बॉडी सो टूडे वी विल नो वॉट आर द सिम्टम्स ऑफ बी ट्वेल्व डेफिशियंसी वॉट आर द कॉजेज ऑफ बी ट्वेल्व डेफिशियंसी एंड मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंटली वॉट ऑल होम्योपैथिक मेडिसिन कैन हेल्प इन दिस कंडीशन so if you are new to my channel before watching the video do not forget to subscribe to the channel and of course hit on the bell icon so that you do not miss on any information that i share with you all so let's get started so vitamin b12 deficiency or the cobalamin deficiency can affect the nervous system of our body and we can get the symptoms pertaining to the nerves like tingling numbness and crawling sensation so all these sensations we can feel whenever the nervous system is affected now why do we get the vitamin b12 deficiency so primarily there can be two reasons reason number 1 that our diet is deficient in b12 so that could be the first reason that we are not taking enough vitamin b12 in our body and that is the reason we are getting the symptoms of b12 deficiency the second and the most important reason will be that your diet is having vitamin b12 in it but your body cannot absorb the b12 so there is poor absorption and as a result of it this cause can also lead to b12 deficiency so the first reason your diet is not having the b12 and the second reason you are having b12 in your diet but your body is not absorbing it now why the body is not absorbing the b12 well there could be some causes like celiac disease ibs crohn's disease or maybe you underwent some kind of weight reduction surgery some part of your stomach was removed because of some surgery some part of the intestine was removed so they can result in improper absorption of the b12 vitamin and as a result of it you can get the symptoms of b12 deficiency now what are the symptoms so as we know that it primarily affects the nervous system the brain and also the red blood cells of the body so the symptoms will be as a general weakness fatigue there will be a feeling of light headedness you may feel drowsy the whole day even after having a good sleep you still feel drowsy so b12 deficiency could be one of the reason along with that there will be tingling sensation and crawling sensation burning maybe some kind of twitching that you experience along with this there can be some gastric symptoms like loss of appetite diarrhea loose motions so these will be the symptoms which can indicate that there may be some kind of deficiencies in the body and maybe it is the b12 deficiency so now coming to the role and scope of homeopathic medicines in such case so the first medicine in homeopathy for the b12 deficiency will be arsenic album now in case of arsenic album we see there is a lot of weakness there is a lot of prostration the patient may have loose motions diarrhea and the most important thing is that there is nightly aggravation of the complaints so there will always be aggravation of all the complaints during the night time or at midnight there will be lot of restlessness anxiety fear and especially at the night time so in cases like this we can consider the homeopathic medicine arsenic album the second medicine for this will be gelsemium now in gelsemium we see there is a lot of weakness lot of prostration even after getting up from sleep the patient will always feel drowsy he cannot open his eyes properly there is a heavy feeling over the eyes 
so there is always always a kind of weakness drowsiness frustration so we can use the medicine gelsemium the next medicine will be causticum now in case of causticum we see there is a lot of weakness in the limbs and there is paralytic kind of weakness in the lower limbs which is ascending kind of a pain so there will be pain which will be ascending from legs to upward and we can also feel there is some kind of pricking sensation along with the pain so in cases like this we can consider the medicine causticum the next medicine for b12 deficiency will be kali fos now if there is a lot of mental confusion insomnia the patient cannot sleep properly there is lot of confusion there is poor concentration the mind is always active whenever the patient is going to sleep still the patient cannot relax cannot sleep why because the mind is constantly thinking thinking and thinking so in cases like this we can consider the medicine kali fos the next medicine will be zincum vitalicum now if we need to explain the medicine zincum metallicum in one word we'll say it as a fog so there will be a lot of mental fog confusion along with that there will be twitching twitching in the muscles of the body there will be chorea there will be some kind of shivering or there will be lameness trembling twitching of the muscles and overall there will always be a feeling of complete mental drowsiness or mental depression and in this cases we can consider the medicine zincum metallicum so these are some of the medicines which can be very very beneficial in case of b12 deficiency or cobalamin deficiency i hope you have enjoyed the information that i have shared with you so do not forget to like share subscribe and of course comment on the video do let me know which topic would you like me to make a video on and i will be definitely posting a video on that topic soon friends if you wish to book an appointment with me you just need to go to my website my website is drarpana.com d r a r p a n a.com so you can just type drarpana.com and uh, my website will come in front of you and then you can book your appointment as per your convenience you can also send a message through whatsapp in my office whatsapp number the number is already given to you and there also you will be provided with the details for booking an appointment with me rest of the details are given to you in the description box you may have a look right now so this is all about b12 deficiency or cobalamin deficiency stay connected stay tuned for more such informative videos let's learn and use homeopathy Thank you so much for watching.